Hi guys! Today I'm going to show you how to make this two colored center of the flower center. It can be flat like this or it can be crowned as I call it because we mix two different heights of paper stripes. We work with fringes. I use my offcuts and in my case these are offcuts from A4 size papers. You may work with letter size papers so you will have a little bit different uh, sizing. My stripes are 21 centimeter or 8 and 1 quarter of an inch long and 4 centimeters or 1 and a half inch wide. So I fold my stripes of paper in half and using Martha Stewart uh, fringe scissors, I just cut them through the whole length on the folded side and then I get this type of fringes. So you can roll a few fringes like this in order to get one spiky center like that. Uh, this spiky knob, which can be your center of the flower center. But this time I want to have them two colors. So I just mix a few stripes and different colors and I do this as usual. You can find the video here on our YouTube channel um, where we show how to make this spiky centrus from scratch and you can find in you can find the link the direct link to this video uh, in this video description so this is a small um, noob which will be too small too thin um, in my flower center so I want it to be more chunky so I add one more stripe but now it is a different color. I still use same width of the stripe so the top of my spiky center is flat. And three stripes of this size enough to fit into my uh, into my fluffy center. We also have a few videos of how to make this type different types this or that or this type of fluffy centers in our channel you can have a look and another way um, now we can make a little bit different a little bit different type of spiky center where one part is uh, smaller or lower and another part is uh, taller so it forms a sort of crown around this spiky knob. So we take two stripes and make a fringe. Again the size of my stripes is eight and one quarter by one and a half inches and another stripe I will take in the same width because I need to get the particular um, thickness of my center but you can see that the stripe is wider and here we go with uh, two and one quarter of an inch or almost um, five and a half centimeters same length because I need this particular particular width of the knob and I do all the same again I just I just sorry about that I just roll the spiky knob I roll one narrow stripe I add the second narrow stripe and then I add a wider one but what I do I watch the bottom because I need the bottom to be absolutely flat 
I glue as I go just a little bit and I fix the end and I make sure that my bottom is flat so you can see that the center of my center is lower and the crown or this outer layer of it is a little bit higher so we get completely different look you can leave you can leave it as is absolutely straight or you can leave straight spikes of the middle part of it and you can fold out those spikes at the of the outer layer so it will be completely different look so now you know how to make two or maybe even three colored centers of your flower centers and how to make them either flat or crowned or with a spiky layer inside enjoy this video try your own centers and don't forget to share your flowers with us send us your photos onto instagram paper pro tutorials or tag us in your posts so we can see we can share your beautiful flowers on our social media and have a nice day bye bye